Well, we've got a murder mystery show at Ohio Theater in Lima. And joining us today, the co-owners of the theater, also in the show, it is the Great Spaghetti Murder. So joining us today, to my immediate left, Michael Bouchon, and we have got Joe Carell. And thanks, guys, for coming today. Thank you, Holly. In costume, as usual. Thank you for doing <laughs> si, that. Si, prego. Okay. It's a no problem. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm playing a priest in this one. It's a little bit different, but he's not, he's not a great priest. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? He's a very bad priest. Oh, okay. Let me tell you, we've been at that parish for a very long time, but we're going to have to change again because but the things that we are finding out about this man is no good. I am not a murderer. That's all I will say about that. Well, that's good to hear from a priest. <laughs> <laughs> but it is a whodunit, right, you guys? So, absolutely. But this really has the audience involved in this one. So tell us about this. Uh, well, this is a, a, a participation show, so it's it's greatly scripted, but a lot of it is improvisation. So the audience is all guests at this wake, a funeral for Vinnie Cannelloni, who has been murdered. And they show up and they mingle with the uh, family members. And then we all sit down to a big, delicious Italian buffet and the scenes are taking place throughout the building. They're taking place during dinner and then you know, you have your choice of who you want to follow. You can see different scenes. So you could come every single night and see a completely different show because the scenes take place simultaneously. So you can't see them all in wow. one showing. Okay. Yeah, it's diff a little different from our last one, Fatal Follies, in where this show is, is definitely more immersive. Uh, it is so much easier for the audience to play along. Mm -hmm. um, there's not this great distance where you sit and you watch from a distance. Um, there are some performances up on the big stage as well, but uh, it's just so easy for the audience to get involved. They don't have to be brave. They don't necessarily have to walk around so much if they don't want to, because mm -hmm. we bring the action to them. Wow. Well, you had your opening weekend, and, and how did it go? Someone new did it each night, and how, how did people react to you guys being right there with them? This show, uh, everyone's a suspect but it's the audience that decides uh, at the end who did it, and then we have different endings. So the, at all of the, uh, the dress rehearsal and then the two performances we had, it was different, uh, different, different murderer. See, that's there. very cool, So it's yeah. really fun. So yeah, it's, it, you can come over and over and like I said, see a different show uh -huh. every single time. And, and you guys are familiar with the show because you did it in Nashville and you said it was a great success. It was, it was our most successful show that we did in Nashville and which is why we decided to, to bring it back. And sure. we, we've expanded it even, even from that. We've added more characters because our, our physical space is larger than what oh, we had okay. in Nashville. So we needed to provide more roles, more characters for people to follow. Right, well, I think, it, what you guys said, there's 15 or 15. something? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so that is quite the cast to follow while you're eating dinner. And speaking yeah. of dinner, a wonderful Italian buffet comes with the ticket, right, when you it, go see the show. It does. My very first rest, uh, restaurant job was when I was 16 in a Italian restaurant that may or may not have been connected. <laughs> If you get my drift. Uh -huh. uh, I showed up as a dishwasher on day one and the entire staff walked out. Ooh. And so at 16 years of age, I was the cook for a huge <laughs> wedding. Um, and then I eventually became their chef. So I know a little something about a sauce. <laughs> <laughs> So you had one opening weekend, but luckily there's many chances yet ahead. We've got a couple weekends coming up, and it's open through June 8th, right, on the weekend. So get your tickets now. Just go online, right? That's the easiest way? Yeah, well, yes. theaterlineman.com. It's that easy. It's a, it's a big party is what it is. And people come, and you just you celebrate. You, you, you just enjoy yourself. Right. So it's, it's not a sit back and you just have to watch. It's just happening all around you. So get a drink and wander around and see what you see. It sounds like a really fun event and something you don't get in Lima, except for right there at Ohio Theater in Lima. That's why we're here. That's why you're here, exactly. <laughs> All right, so get your tickets now. It's a really, sounds like a great production, The Great Spaghetti Murders. Michael and Joe, thanks for coming today. Thanks, thanks Holly. Holly. All right, don't go away. First edition continues in a moment.